Welcome back my children to another One Piece card game opening video. Today I will be opening the very first starter deck from the One Piece card game of course. So I bought these as a lot on eBay. They cost me like a hundred something for all, uh, it was up to number 10 I believe, number 10. So I'm gonna be opening them one by one. I kind of forgot it's 10 of them or 11 of the starter starter decks i know i i believe there's more now they've added more like number 12 13 and such potentially i kind of forgot but this is the first one the very very first one and this is the japanese version of course it's from 2022 when they um uh, brought out one piece card game so yeah this is the very first starter deck and I have all of them for the Japanese versions. I obviously don't know what it says. It says something like Tapa de Sinomo Adanamo Adanim Zino Armo. Something like that. But um there we go. Anyways, I wanna open it and see what cards it has inside because I don't know. I never bothered to check because I wanted I want to go in blind with my eyes closed. How do I open this? I'm trying to see. Oh, okay, I see it has tape. No wonder. I kinda wanna open it from the, the bottom. Yeah. So here's my knife. There we go. Awesome. Imagine it has something else inside and no one piece cards. Yeah, there we go. There's a... It's empty. Nothing else. So there's like a Japanese booklet. I guess it shows how to play the game and such. And potentially other products. So, um, yeah, I really don't know what it says. There's some cards, some examples. And I guess it does show how you could play it, potentially. I'm not quite sure. Ah, yes, this is the, the mat. So character, area, then leader, leader card, stage card, deck, trash, as in the graveyard, like Yu-Gi-Oh! Cost area, deck, wait, two decks, what? You, what? You, two decks, I, I don't know. And then this life. I, I really don't know what that means. I most likely will never play the card game. Maybe I will. But uh, not like for tournaments and whatnot. Maybe just for fun. Anyways. Um, that's the plastic. And these are the decks. There's two decks actually. I just realized that. Cool. Um, this one. This one has Vivi. And this one has Usopp. Not sure which one I want to open first. I see, I think there's like a holographic inside of here. I don't know about this one. Yeah, there is. I kind of see it in the border over there in the back. Um, I like the back of this one. It's like, um, what's the name? Tor Torquist Blue? Tor 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 it's like, I like the blue, but I just don't know the name. I know it starts with a T. I always don't know how to pronounce it. Turtle blue, maybe. Torquis, Torquus, Torquis, Torquius. I don't know. It might be T.O. blue. I'm not quite sure. And then I think there's the regular back. So I'm not sure why this card specifically has a different back. I'm not going to check. But I'll open the one with Usopp first. I like it. I like how you can just slide this off. Very cool. All right. So obviously that's Usopp. Let's see. Yeah, same back as the one over here. So Usopp. Usopp again. This is the two years later Usopp. One uh, after the time skip. Usopp again. Okay, how many Usops are there? Are these all Usops? Oh, there's Karu. I love Karu. He is the best duck in the whole world. Even better than the the real life ducks. 
he is the best fictional duck ever. But uh, this kind of looks like they got it out of the anime. Kind of sucks a little bit. This is a little much better. But um, who knows? Maybe they did draw it. And it's just that good that it looks like from the anime. But there's Karu. It's still a cool card. It has no text now that I realize it. This one at least has some text. I don't know what it says. This one doesn't say no text. It just says character. Right, so Karu, Karu, Karu again. Another Karu. There's Sanji. Very cool. He's doing his flaming, flaming kick. So Sanji, Sanji again. I'm assuming four Sanjis. Yeah, there we go. Then there's Jinbei. So one, two, three, four Jinbeis. So it seems like it's four of each card. They are all characters. Yeah, they're all characters. All right. Then there's Chopper. Car Chopper in your car, huh? He has the, the, the candy, the cotton candy, and he's licking it. So uh, one chopper, two choppers, three choppers, four choppers in the car. Ooh, that is Zoro. Are there four of him? Watch, there's only going to be one, the one you want to have more of holographics, and there's only one of it. Oh, there is. Oh, there's two. Okay. At least two. Not bad. That is so cool. He's the holographic one. So I'm assuming this one might have Luffy as holographic for sure. So this one has Zoro. Very badass. And he's a character as well. Yeah, so two holographics of Zoro. Then there's Nami showing off the goods. So one Nami, two Namis, three Namis. Four Namis. Sanji will be very happy. Oh, there's Robins showing off the goods as well. Um, Robin is prettier than Nami, in my opinion. But there's Robin number one, Robin number two, Robin number three, Robin number four. So it, it seems like every character card has four, uh, except the holographics, of course. So that's the first... Uh, I'm assuming the first half of the deck. Then this is the next half, potentially. Also, I did not count how many cards there were. Let me count quickly, I guess. So there's uh, three, five, three, ten, three, ten. Let me just do it like this. That's 10, that's 15, 20, 25, so 30. There's 30 on this side, and I'm assuming this is 30 as well. Anyways, uh, there's Vivi. Vivi again. Vivi again. Vivi again. I'm going to show the artwork a little better. Next is Frankie. So one Frankie. Two Frankies. Three Frankies. Four Frankies. So they are all characters. So far it's only character cards, nothing else. There's Brook. He is so cool. So one Brook, two Brooks. Seriously, two Brooks? He's not even holographic. Whatever. Anyways, there's a, uh, also, do they have the same backs? Yes, they do. This one is Chopper um, as the fluff form. I kind of forgot the name of it. Um. Defense something? No, wait. Yeah, I forgot. But anyways, um, oh, this one is a, an event. Cool. It's in color, so very cool. But uh, yeah, I don't know what type of event it is. So there's one, two, then uh, another event. Where's this supposed to be? Oh, there's a uh, Kuma. When Luffy attacks him after the time skip. Because uh, before they were not strong enough to take down a Kuma or a Pacifista. And now Luffy is stronger than a P Pacifista. At least able to destroy one. Kind of looks harsh knowing the, the backstory to Kuma now. 
because uh, of the egghead arc whatever anyways that's one and then two then there's uh, Sanji and another event it's pretty much in the same pose as here yeah this is the time skip Sanji and this is before the time skip because you could tell the difference so this is before he became stronger this was in Annie's lobby if I'm not incorrect so there's a uh, Sanji again the event card oh my goodness then um, the thousand sunny a stage for some reason it's a stage there's two of them oh my goodness and there's Luffy a leader cool so he's the leader card and basically the one on the, in the box obviously very cool that looks so cool actually let me compare it to these lower one all right yeah they look so much different luffy obviously looks better well i, I like it because of the background the red background and everything the artwork as well but zoro also looks badass of course so this one is a character this one is a leader very cool looking oh there's two okay so there's leader luffy and then character luffy awesome this one is the better one of course that looks so cool very very cool oh there's two character luffy's okay cool i had a feeling so there's three holographics on in this pile of the, of the deck This one is the better one, of course. It would have been nice if I was able to get the English ones, but I think the English ones are actually more expensive than the actual Japanese ones, which kind of sucks. Maybe at some point. I do two, I do have two of these decks in, in uh, English, just two of them. But uh, maybe I'll get the rest in English. So this, I kind of forgot what these are called. But it's just a, a thousand. Oh, they have the this background. Seriously, that many of these? It's a three, six, ten of these. Wow. Okay, let me count. Let me see if these are the same numbers and whatnot. So it was ten of these. Yeah, ten. Um, oh, wait, wait. Yeah, fifteen. Okay, fifteen. 20, 25, wait, did I count wrong? Okay, there's 10 of these. Yeah, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31. Okay, for some reason, 31 here. And these were 30, right, as well? Yeah, so... 61 in total 61 cards in total for some reason instead of just 60 they added one extra i guess because of the leader card i'm, I'm assuming but yeah that's i'm assuming that's a full deck i would not know how it works but uh, regardless it's pretty cool i love the leader card obviously and the other two holographics zoro and luffy and then the other cards are also cool I do have some English products of One Piece card games to open at some point. I am saving saving them. But uh, for now, that is it for now for the One Piece card game. I will be opening these little by little. Uh, so this is the first starter deck. Then I'll have the next one, then the next, then the next, then the next. But yeah, that's it for now. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you liked the video. Comment down below. Thanks. Also got the video in the playlist on above. And I'll see you guys in the next video.